This photograph has symbolized Chipko movement since forever. Commonly found in school textbooks and articles on the internet, just like for you, this picture was equivalent to Chipko for me. Yet, this turned out to be not quite true. I came across a research paper called Chipko Movement of Floated Myths and Flouted Realities written by retired IIM Calcutta professor Dr. Jayant Bandupadhyay and published in 1999. And this is what I found. All photographs of Chipko actions represent enactments. There was no photographer around in the remote mountain forests. The only reported incidents that Dr. Bandupadhyay is talking about is when Dhoom Singh Negi, a prominent leader of the Chipko movement, stopped felling of trees on 8th January 1978. The question remains, were there any photographers to capture this particular moment? I couldn't find any proof of that, so I decided to ask the man himself. <laughs> मैं बता रहा हूं वो समय तो हम जो ही लोग थे ना मैं तो पेट पर यूं अपने बाहों में लिया हुआ था और उनकी क्यों बालियां खड़ी थी द स्टेटमेंट फ्रॉम मिस्टर नेगी ओपन पेंडोराज बॉक्स फॉर मी बट वाज दिस द ओनली इंसिडेंट डॉक्टर बंदोपाध्याय शेयर्ड हिज थ्योरी विद अस ऑन व्हाई ही थिंक्स मोस्ट ऑफ द फोटोग्राफ्स ऑफ द चिपको मूवमेंट वाज स्टेज्ड द मूवमेंट इज ऑन ए पर्टिकुलर फॉरेस्ट प्लॉट दैट हैज टू बी मेंशनड इन एनी फोटोग्राफ the movement is on a particular date mm. that has to be mentioned mm. the movement is by some people their names need to be out the movement is from people of a village or a number of villages those villages has to be identified all the boxes are ticked none of the newspapers or other sources published any of these details about either this photograph or any other if you take a closer look at the photograph, another interesting aspect becomes visible, the tree. According to Mr. Negi, So I contacted an IFS officer in Uttarakhand to check whether this tree was one of those trees. This raised a massive red flag, so I decided to dig a little deeper. I went back and checked some other articles and research papers about the Chipko movement and the results were shocking. For instance, this newspaper article published in July 1996 states, Many international newspapers extensively talked about Vandana Shiva's involvement in the movement, like this article which was published on 23rd January 1996 and written by a Malaysian journalist Lo Foon Fong in The Sun. To confirm whether these nuggets of information are true or not, I again went back to Mr. Negi. Well, I guess this photograph has many hidden secrets and I tried to unfold them as much as I could because the right information needs to be out there, including acknowledging the people who did all the work. If you have any information about this photograph and the Chipko movement, please let us know in the comments below.